today I'm going to show you how I color eyes. So if you're ready, let's go. So for this tutorial, I chose a drawing of Judy Hopps that I have on my DeviantArt. You can check the full file later. So first you pick the base color. Her eyes are purple, so I chose purple. I use paint bucket to paint the eyes the base color. Get another layer and clip it to the layer below. Get a darker color and paint the upper half of the eye with it. Now get another layer, clip it too, get an even darker color and use airbrush to paint the upper half of the eye with it as well. Your next step is to get another layer, get a darker color closer to black and use airbrush in a smaller size to paint the upper half of the eye, but in a smaller area closest to the line art. The next step is creating another layer and getting the pen brush to make the pupil. You can do it by creating an oval shape right in the middle of the eye. I usually use the exact same color I've just used to airbrush the upper half of the eye. Create another layer and put it under the pupil layer. Get a lighter color than the base color and use water brush to create this U shape around the pupil and the bottom half of the eye. Choose an even lighter color and clip another layer also under the pupil layer. Repeat this U shape but using water brush in a smaller size and do it closer to the pupil. Now we're going to start adding details. Use the same color you've just used to add more shine and make the eye look more colorful and pretty. I usually add more shine depending on the character's personality. If it's a bright and happy character, I'm going to add a lot of glow. If not, I'm going to minimize it as much as I can, for example, for a Yandere character. Now I pick white and the, for the first time I'm doing a layer over the pupil. I pick white and add these two little circle shapes right next to the pupil. And then I'm going to repeat the circular shape but right next to the line art on the opposite diagonal of the pupil. For the next step we're going to create a new layer and put it on add mode. I'm going to get a complementary color, in this case I chose pink, and I'm going to airbrush the bottom half of the eye with it. It's going to make the eye look a lot more shiny. Now I'm going on the line art layer, I'm going to lock it and I'm going to paint the line art. Remember where you drew that white circle? I'm going to paint the line art where it meets the white circle to complete a full circle. Now I'm going to get a dark pink and I'm going to airbrush the edges of the line art. The color I pick usually depends on the color palette I'm working with for the whole drawing. Sometimes I don't even paint the line art, but I think it makes the eye look a lot more shiny and bright. So this is it for this drawing, next I'm going to show you a part of a speed paint I have recently posted so that you guys can see the process again but in a different drawing with a different color.
this is it for this tutorial. I really hope you guys have enjoyed it and learned something from it. I don't think this is the only way to color eyes, but I'm just showing you how I do it. Please, if you use this tutorial, let me know and post your drawings. I would love to see them.